minutes, three minutes, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Good evening to all of you. Thank you all for being here. Uh, and thank you to Home Builders Association, who is actually my work neighbor. I work next door to you all. Thank you all for doing this. And thank you, Chris, for, for uh, doing all this tonight. Um, I'm an occupational therapist. I've worked and lived in Lowndes County for 19 years. My wife, Lana Mohanty, is here. Our two kids are here. The youngest one is two years old. We didn't bring her here because she could have taken Chris role if we brought her today. <laughs> so um, thank you all again. Um, you know, um, I'm asking your vote so that we all can join hands. I personally believe Georgia's best days are still ahead. So we can do things together that our generation and their generation will be proud of our courage, our conviction, our similarities, not our differences. I'm going to get straight to the point. When I'm elected, I will work hard to gain the trust and confidence of fellow legislators so we can protect Hope Scholarship. Georgia Medicaid actually is the single most reason of budget consuming, so we are not able to do anything anywhere else. As a hands-on healthcare provider, I will, walk, I will reach across the aisle and use my experience that I hear from families and patients and fellow healthcare providers so that we can create a preventive healthcare plan so we can manage Georgia Medicaid sp spending. That actually is the number one reason Georgia's budget is always behind. We are always falling behind, not able to manage. Quite honestly, ethics reform also has bothered many people. I believe term limit is necessary too. And I, I want to congratulate you all of you who voted to make ethics reform a number one priority. I want you to know I have the courage and I have the backbone to stand up to anyone. I want to build a bridge where every Georgian can walk. I'm asking your vote so together we can make, we can rebuild Georgia so we, our children can have a prosperous life a better life than we have. Thank you and God bless you. God bless America.